Hey everyone and welcome back to the channel. My name is the Trading Car Frog and I'll be your host. Today we have some pretty fun things to do. Uh, I'll be opening some Yu-Gi-Oh packs. We have eight tournament packs uh, and we also have ourselves uh, quite a few booster packs uh, that I had loose. Um, I'll explain basically how I got these because some of them have stories, some of them don't, but anyways. And we also have a giveaway that we'll be announcing uh, further down the line in this video, so please stay tuned for that. Um, but yeah, let's let's get started, okay? Let's get started. Um, I've been saving these OTS packs for a while, as you guys can see. There are some from the 10, 14, 15, and 16th editions, so that's, uh, that's quite a few years. <laughs> uh, I tried to keep... Um, some of these packs sealed for future videos like I'm doing right now with you guys. Uh, I've been saving some uh, here and there. Sometimes I open some, sometimes I don't. I like to have variety, so that's nice. Uh, but I felt like 8 packs would be too short even if I uh, announced a giveaway. So I decided to include 5 Genesis Impact packs uh, that I had loose. I'm still looking to get some of the Link cards for this archetype right here. Um, I also had an extra Blazing Vortex pack, and I had a Hidden Summoners booster pack that I won in a giveaway at a store. Um, it's it's local store-ish. It's a uh, it's like an hour from home, maybe thirty between thirty minutes and sixty minutes from home. So it's not local, but I do frequent that store uh, very often. So uh, I, I got that in a giveaway from buying packs. Uh, during a special promotion event, and the same for those packs in the back. I've been saving them up through promotion events. So, um, we have seven packs here, we have eight in the back. Let's start with some of these bad boys right here. Hopefully today we'll get an ultimate rare from the OTS packs. I haven't pulled an ultimate rare from OTS packs on this channel. Uh, I've done it before on my previous channel. Uh, I pulled from an astral pack. Uh, quite a few because I bought like this thick of astral packs. Anyways, maybe we'll pull something, maybe we won't. Uh, we have Phonon Pulse Dragon. Miracle Dig is a very old card to be reprinted, that's interesting. Uh, but yeah, not the best start, but still not a bad one. Let's go with Genesis Impact. Uh, as I've mentioned, I am trying to get some of those uh, um, evil twins. Yeah, the live twins are the mo main deck monsters, and the evil twins are the ones from the extra deck, right? Oh, Unicorn, not bad. Evil Twin Challenge, Endymion, Sinet, Invoked, and uh, Tris Magistus are super rare from this pack. No idea if that is any good, but yeah, it's something, right? Let's go with another OTS pack 16. Uh, I don't quite remember all the good pulls in these packs, but I do know that the ultimates are always something that you want to get. Um, I'm also pretty confident that either 15 or 16 has some very good supers, and I also collect the token cards from the OTS packs, so maybe we'll pull some of those for my collection. We have, ooh, nice, Cyberstein, something from back in the days. This is nostalgic for me, I like this. I've got so many Cybersteins through the years, but uh, I never get tired of getting more, because it used to be a shut and jump um, uh, prize card at some point, and that was very expensive. So you know, when you're when you're a kid and you want it, but it's like hundreds of dollars, and you're a kid, so your parents won't get you something stupid like that. Obviously, you get attached to it, even if you don't play it. <laughs> Once you get it, you just want to keep getting it more and more. We have uh, Fabled and Wraith. Very cool artwork on this card. Like, this is some crisp artwork. Very nice. Like, the blade probably isn't sharp, but you know they're gonna bludgeon you to death with it. <laughs> uh, Spriggan Captain Sargas. I do like the artwork on Spriggans. Ojama Pink. That's nice. We have a Tri Brigade Rendezvous. Neat. Uh, let's do some 15. Let's see if we can get something from this because we've been pretty dry with our 16, although Cyberstein I think is worth a couple bucks. Uh, we've, we've still been pretty dry. Amor Factor Pain, the Imagination Drake Overlord, DDR, Dance Dance Revolution, 
and cross over. I guess this was decent for the warrior decks. I'm I'm not sure I didn't really play the warrior decks, but you know it's it's something, right? Let's open another Genesis Impact. Who knows? Maybe we'll get a collector's rare. That would be insane. I haven't pulled a single collector's rare in all of the uh, new sets. To be fair, I haven't bought that many of them, but like I've never pulled anything epic. Life Twin Kissicle, nice. Although I already have all the main deck ones, this is still interesting. I'm pretty sure Phoenix is a good card to get though. And I know n nothing about the Drytrons, but I do know their meta, so I guess this might be a good one. I don't know, I would assume that only the foil ones are expensive. Let's open 814. Let's see if we can get something eventually that will make me go, wow, that's pretty good. Icarus Attack, that used to be pretty good. Atlantean Dragoons, that's pretty okay. And Raid Raptor Force Strix. Uh, before the reprint, this was an expensive card, but I don't think nowadays it's worth anything at all. Okay, let's go down to the Trading Card Frog Giveaway! Thank you, Giveaway Frog, for hosting this, right? Let's go to the giveaway. So this giveaway had the milestone objective of reaching 50 subs on the channel. We reached it during a live stream. I was very excited, but then like the next day we went down to 49 again. But still, since we reached 50, I'm still gonna do the giveaway. I'm, I'm a man of my words. Uh, if we reach a goal, I'll consider it done. Uh, I'm a little disappointed it went down the next day though. That was kind of sad, but we'll do what we want with what we have. Like, anyways. Uh, so the giveaways on this channel for those of you guys who are new and uh, a quick reminder for those of you guys who aren't basically what we do is um, There is a rule to participate basically uh, There is the Instagram account. There will be a picture with like this 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 will be the picture, okay, and uh, basically you just have to uh, follow me on Instagram and or YouTube and you comment in that picture and that'll be that i will then later on um, probably during a live stream or during a video sometime eventually um at, by the end of the contest i'll put all of the names of the the usernames of the people who have commented on that post on instagram and uh, i'll just do a random number generator and that will decide who wins so it's not that complicated uh, as long as you're following or uh, subscribing and you comment there you're entered. It's not difficult. I mean, it's free to sub and or follow. And uh, I mean, that's basically just the thing. Uh, the winner will get to choose if they want the Pokemon package or the Yu-Gi-Oh package. It's free shipping no matter where you live. Uh, although I don't do tracking unless you want me to, but that will add some expense to it. But I don't think this is worth much tracking at this point. Anyways, um, thing is, I will be giving away extra stuff, not just these packages. Uh, for the Yu-Gi-Oh stuff, I will be adding some uh, Korean cards uh, to the package. I haven't decided which ones yet, so I didn't want to include them here, but they will be included. I'll give you uh, guys quite a few interesting stuff. Uh, for the Pokemon stuff, uh, I'll be adding some Detective Pikachu cards. Uh, so probably like some starters like uh, Bulbasaur, or maybe some stuff like that. Uh, I'll try to include some interesting stuff from the uh, collectible set of Detective Pikachu to add to this. And uh, here for you guys is a French Sun and Moon base pack. Uh, so I don't think a lot of you guys live in French regions of the world. So this might be interesting for you guys. You know, it's uh, fun for your collection. And for the Yu-Gi-Oh guys uh, and girls, we've got the Dark Neil Storm pack. This is a little older, so not that old, but it's still been like at least a year or two since this is released. So it might be interesting for you guys as well. Um, of course, there's also the bonus part of the giveaway. If we reach the next milestone while the giveaway is going on, we will be giving away the whole thing to the one lucky winner instead of having them choose. So since this milestone was 50, if we reach 100 subscribers on YouTube while the giveaway is going on, the winner will get the whole package. Same applies with um, Instagram. If we reach, I think we're at 300 and something now. So if we reach 400 followers on Instagram 
and uh, YouTube doesn't change, doesn't matter, it's one or the other, I'm, I, I don't really care, I just want to be able to reach out to more people, right? Uh, so if we reach 400 followers on Instagram, that will also count and uh, that will be considered as reaching the next milestone for this whole package to be given away to one lucky winner. Uh, so yeah, the giveaway, I've mentioned how to enter it, but I kept hesitating on the delay. Um, I don't know exactly when this video will be posted online. I am filming this uh, <laughs> while I'm studying for my finals. So it's just like a, a breather I'm using for filming for you guys. So I will edit right now in the bottom of the screen, like somewhere between my hands or my fingers, whatever. I'll put the date at which the giveaway will end and uh, that will be that, okay? I hope you guys are following me. Anyways, free giveaway, free cards, might as well enter. I wish you guys the best of luck and let's proceed with more packs. Uh, the last pack we've opened was an OTS pack, so let's open some Genesis Impact. But yeah, um, I hope you guys will get lucky on that giveaway. Bottomless Trap Hole, Cyber's Gadget, Book of the Law, and Drytron Fafnir. No idea yet again if this is worth anything, but it's not something I was looking for, so I guess I'm just going to put it down and not be excited. If it is anything interesting, please mention in the comment section down below because I might have just skipped over it and not realized. Uh, let's open an OTS 15 again. The red pack is giving me vibes. Vampire's Domain, Armed Dragon level 7, and Shadal Dragon. Nice! Uh, this is something I'll be enjoying in my collection. I think I only had one foil dragon. So this will help uh, bling out my Shadal deck that I'm not using but still keeping in my collection. This is nice. This is nice. I, I like that. that. That's good. Red pack was nice to us. Let's go with Hidden Summoners. I think there's some pretty interesting stuff in here. Uh, it's not young. <laughs> it's, a, it's an older pack. But I believe there's an Ash Blossom in this set that is worth over $20 Canadian for sure because the common is at $20. So this, this could be a good pack. Was it this set or was it the other one before it from that same line of packs? Anyways, Onslaught, Tatsunoko, Fusion, Fulfillment, and nope, nothing. But we did get a pretty cool Mayakashi Synchro. I do remember when these came out, I was pretty into them because I still pretty much enjoy collecting um, zombies. I am a big zombie monster fan. And um, yeah, I mean, I collected the Mayakashis, never got around to actually making them work though. They were okay, but they never got any decent tournament level uh, power. Let's open another pack. OTS 14. Please give us some luck. Phantom Knights of Ancient Cloak. That's uh, a few cents. Weeping Idol and another Force Trick. Nice. Yippee. I mean, it's not a bad card. Don't get me wrong. But I would like some variety. Like, I would like to get an ultimate rare. Please, someone. Please. <laughs> give me something good. Born from Dragonus. Benton. Phoenix. Secret Password. I've already got quite a few of these. As I've mentioned earlier, I've got the full main deck. I just need the extra deck. But it's nice. It's it's nice. We won't complain. It is an interesting card. Let's go into OTS Tournament Pack 10. This was before they changed the logo, so this could be cool. We might pull something interesting from this uh, older pack. Please, please give us the goods. Assault Mode Activate. Super Quantal and, oh, okay, Sunlight Wolf, super rare. Uh, that's not bad. It used to be worth some money. I think at some point it was like 10 to $20 for the one card. But now there's an Ultra that's been reprinted after this. And I think people are going to play the Ultra over the Super because it's, you know, it's higher rarity. Although it's basically easier to get from what I remember. Anyways, uh, up to now, we haven't been blessed. We've pulled some okay stuff, but I don't think we're even close to making our money back. At all. <laughs> Drytron again, Nightmare Phoenix again. Wow, a lot of Nightmare Phoenixes. And Life Twin Lila. Oh, that's, that's cute. Okay, so we got both Life Twins for the main deck. 
It's, uh, it's something. Go on, camera, focus. You darn goof. There we go. It's, it's something, right? It's not great, but it's not bad. Final pack of the day. Let's go, tournament pack 16. Let's go. I'll try to not destroy this one. Sometimes I like to keep a few packs in my collection because, you know, pack artworks are part of the promotional stuff that I like to collect. Uh, Reptilian Hydra. Nice, I guess. And okay, well, that's that's nothing I was looking forward to, but maybe it's worth something. Virtual World Gate Quinglong. Uh, this is definitely playable because, you know, Virtual World are uh, meta so yeah maybe maybe there's something there i i don't know I'll, I'll check it out but uh yeah this basically concludes today's video i hope you guys enjoyed uh i guess i could give you guys a quick recap but we haven't pulled anything incredible from what i remember uh we we pulled a dragon which is nice i think salmon great is nice as well force tricks are interesting i don't know if it's worth anything we have cyber stein which might be good but yeah, that's pretty much it for today. We've got quite a few phoenixes, and uh, that's it. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed today's vid. Uh, I know I did, and uh, please check out the giveaway. Uh, say hi to the giveaway frog. And uh, until next time, guys, it has been a pleasure. Ciao. I've got a few thanks to give. First, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed, please like, sub, bell, comment, share, etc. It really helps. Second, I want to give a big thanks to my friend BuddhaBelly42 for making the animation for the channel's intro. It is much appreciated. Go check him out on his social media accounts. Third, but not the least, I want to say a huge thank you to everyone who supports me, my channel, and its mission. Especially the ones on Patreon. You peeps out there are the ones making this work. On that note, Follow me on my other social media accounts. Lots of bonus content to entertain you guys and gals. So check it out.